Well, the impressions are pretty good because uh, last night Crane had three points. Uh, so far this uh, today, he had one in the post, so he could at least have one goal there. But uh, uh, I would say that I'm not really here to just evaluate that way. It's just to, to see how they are developing and where they are standing right now. And we all know what kind of player they're going to be at the end. And uh, these two guys, both of them, are, it's not going to be Dipsy Dool guy from Europe. So this is going to be more up and down power forward and, and power defenseman. Well, I would say that most likely we'll play in the American Hockey League next year. And uh, hopefully we have such a team there that can take care of him. Because it's still, uh, for these kids going out in the American Hockey League, they, uh, they are young and they need the experience to play with the senior players. So hopefully we have a good older players that sort of can ease him into the game at professional level. What happened in most of the cases here now is that uh, because of the salary cap issues, it's, uh, it's not that very common that you do trades anymore. I mean, we saw in an Archangeli trade yesterday, but uh, there are very fewer today than it was maybe five or ten or fifteen years ago. That means when you're drafting players that you have to look what you actually do need. Sometimes you would say, why don't draft the best available player, but you might end up having seven goalies and you can't play the game then because you cannot trade them and uh, as of now there aren't really that kind of a value of a, a new or drafted player because there's no proof of what it's going to be like. You might tra trade a first round pick and get the third round back. So now nobody knows today what that's going to end up being. It's today that you have to draft, you got to draft small, tricky players, you get to draft centermen that might be bigger, maybe not as quick, and you might have to draft the right winger who is more a power forward. So you have the whole chemistry there of all of us the team should be look like in five to ten years from now.